Hey guys, welcome back to the Law Dog Project 365, episode 446. Today what we're doing is another episode on focal flossing. Now, a couple episodes ago, I talked about how to create a focal area of compression using only mobility floss. Today what we're doing is using that idea and making a little bit more of a broad compression, but it's still going to be much more focal than using just the, uh, the traditional way that we talked about flossing. This is gonna be used for the larger muscles rather than the small appendages and over tendons that we used last time. I'll show you how it's done. We're gonna have a golf ball and some mobility band here, okay? This isn't the traditional mobility floss. It's wider, right, because what we're gonna be able to do is use this golf ball to kind of cause some compression around an area. So if I'm gonna do this, to kind of mobilize, we use a lot all the time, we use, we use mobility floss a lot all the time to get into this supra patellar region and this quad region right here. So basically, if I'm gonna use this technique, the area of the technique obviously can be used anywhere, it can use be back of the calf, bicep, uh, even in the back if you want to as well. What we're gonna do here is we, rate, we lay the golf ball over top the area we wish to mobilize. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna wrap this around as you can see, the golf ball is enveloped within the mobility floss, okay? And then what we do is we just go ahead and we spend some time pulling the floss over. Now, uh, the amount of compression depends on how much I pull over top of the band. If I want a lot of compression and I want to use this, air, this focal area, um, if I, if I want it to be super intense, then all I do is I just pull over more. If I'm looking to keep it a little bit less intense, then what I could do is I can actually, once it's enveloped, I could just come out to the side, okay, and then you're not gonna see as much compression over that ball. So in any case, whenever I'm done with that, okay, I go ahead and I'm gonna wrap just like I would in any other flossing technique. Now, see, here's the cool thing about this. When I'm gonna do something on, say, the squat, uh, when I'm gonna do something on the quad, let's say we can use a functional exercise like the squat, where I'm gonna be able to lengthen the tissue, okay, and, and shorten the tissue while it's under contraction, or while it's under compression, and it has a focal area of compression where you can obviously see the golf balls resting. So the, the, the mobilization is as simple as squatting once we get this set up like it is right now. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do my normal air squat and you can see how that ball kind of stays right where it is and it's compressing down on the tip of the quad, right? So we use this, go ahead and we would do 20 or so, spend two to four minutes very slow, three, to three seconds down, three seconds up, one, two, three, one, two, three. Repeat that, and we can even move the ball to any area where we ever have, where we have, you know, certain uh, certain amounts of tissue tension, tissue adhesion. All right, try this one out. See if it works for you. It's a different way of using uh, mobility floss and mobility floss type objects. Until tomorrow, we're optimizing function to optimize performance.